And that gets me into another subject. You can, you can either do a blank or really a blank page uh, and start assembling these modules or blocks uh, to put together a page or a post, but you can also use pre-made templates for you. And I'll show you just a few. So you don't have to do the contact page the way I did it, you could find another template. So uh, this is a template that's available in wordpress.com. I'm doing a contact um, and it, it lays it all out for you. There's the text, there's the header, let's get in touch. There are the social media links. Of course, you put in your own uh, hyperlinks there. And the same thing with your photo. You would not use her photo, you're gonna replace it. So you click on replace and that will carry you to where you can get uh, images to put in a, a fresh image on this. Another template is a team template. Uh, if you're working with a team in a small business or if even on a blog, you have others working with you on the blog. Uh, th again, this is laid out for you. Uh, the, the photo that you can easily replace, uh, the text, uh, you can, uh, you can uh, change that if you wish, the other photos, and uh, even the dog is on the member on the team. So again, it's all laid out for you and the, in terms of the presentation and sample content, and you just edit that away to get a, a workable product for your, for your website. And then I have, uh, well, we can look at other examples. You could uh, have one for services. You could have another one for, uh, for about me, uh, but that gives you an idea, I think, of what uh, templates are all about. 